Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. So in today's session, we'll discuss how to fix the error which is experienced in Python, that is pip is not recognized as internal or external command. So if you are using the Python libraries, you might be experiencing this kind of errors while installing the libraries. Because if you want to work on the libraries, first we need to install the libraries and then only we have to use the libraries in Python. So in order to install the libraries, you need to use the pip command to install any library in Python. So while installing that library, you will be experiencing this particular error. So first let us know what is the reason for getting this kind of error. So one thing is improper setting of path in environmental variables. So if the path was not set properly in the environmental variables, we'll get the error pip is not recognized as an internal or external command. So only one solution for this is we need to set the path properly. See, first let's, let us check this one, go to the command prompt and first let us check whether the Python has been installed in our system. Then only we can install the libraries. So for that, just type Python and press enter, you will get the Python shell. So if you got this shell, automatically that implies the Python has been installed in our system. So Python is already available in our system. So I will exit from this Python shell. Now I am going to install NumPy. I just want to work on NumPy, numerical Python. So I'll, I will just try to install the NumPy here. So here I'm getting some pip is not recognized as an internal or external command. That means the set, uh, the, pro, the path has not been set in my system. So in order to set that, go to the this PC, right click on this PC, go to the properties and here go to the advanced system settings. And here you will be finding the environmental variables button, click on that one. You'll be finding the two things. One is user variables and system variables. And in the user variables, click on path and edit. And here you can see there is a path. Okay. So we need to set the path where the Python has been installed in our system. So actually there is a path, but still it was not working because see, first let us move on to the path where the Python has been installed in our system. So go to the users and the local system name, go to the app data and local and coming to the programs and Python, Python 39. And this is the path which is available here, but we are using the pip command to install the libraries. We are using the pip command. So pip command will be available in the scripts folder. Pip command is available in the scripts folder, pip, pip 3.9 and pip 3. So you need to set the path till the scripts folder. Okay, Python 39 and scripts also you need to add it. So you can see if you edit this one, the Python, uh, the, this, this path ends at a Python 39. So simply select this one and copy paste. So here uh, Python 39 and up to scripts, we need to set the path. So just click on OK. And here also the same thing, select the path and click on edit. And here also you will be finding the path, but it is up to 39 only, Python 39 only. So you need to add the scripts also. Scripts. Right, click on OK, OK, and OK. Now, exit the DOS uh, command prompt, and again, once again, we'll restart the command prompt. Now, you just try to install NumPy. Now, you will not get that particular error because the path has been set till the scripts folder because the scripts folder is having the pip command. You can see the successfully installed NumPy without any error. So the pip is not recognized error has been overcome. So just we have set the path properly. That means remember you need to set the path till the scripts folder.
right so hope you understood this session so if you are having any doubts regarding this one feel free to post your doubts in the comment section definitely i will try to clarify all your doubts and if you really enjoyed my session like my session share my session with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel thanks for watching thank you very much